The seed fair is to promote uh, drought tolerant crops, for example, like drought tolerant maize and other crops that farmers are growing that are drought tolerant. As you know, that this year in Southern Africa we had El Nino, so it was important that we bring some of the seed companies that we are working with to show some of the drought tolerant maize that, uh, that we have. You know, sea meat. In the past 10 years, we have been working on this to develop uh, drought tolerant maize. And now, drought tolerant maize is, is available and it's been marketed by the, by the different uh, seed companies. And beside drought tolerant maize, we have uh, orange maize. Orange maize is a, is a pro vitamin A maize. That means it's, uh, once people eat that maize, then they'll be able to get the, effect, uh, the benefits of. Of vitamin A. The benefits of the seed fair is actually to tell the farmers in Motoko and surrounding areas that we have drought tolerant maize so that they can also get the information that these products are there. They can also know who is actually marketing the seed so that when it's time now to plant they can go to the to the seed companies and get the, the right information and get the right the right seed for their for their environment. Uh, for quite a long time, we've been speaking uh, to Simit. But today, we really have realized their duty. And we are very, very happy to talk about what they are doing in our area. This seed fair today aims at promoting knowledge and information sharing about drought tolerant and nutritious maize varieties that were bred through collaboration between my ministry and CIMIT. Besides improved seed, the fair also promotes the use of good agronomic practices such, such as conservation agriculture and also crop livestock interactions. We hope that the seed fair will help to avail information of different crop types which will mitigate against climatic uncertainty. We are encouraging farmers to, to, to adopt uh, the planting of uh, such crops as the orange maize. It increases um, the food security aspect and also because it can be grown in all natural regions of the country, it becomes um, a commodity for everyone to grow. It was a platform for us to get feedback from the farmers who have used our seeds as well we manage as well to sell the seeds here and to the farmers I believe that it was a good interaction point when we were telling them about our varieties and where they can find them this season. As Prime Seed Co, we have benefited in terms of one visibility. Just being out here, where there are a group of farmers, every person who is here is a potential a client. Orange 
nokuda kokuti zvachinoita so dzimwe dzengo haugona kuzona zvakanaka pachinenge chichikura asi kana hauzonoti wapinda munda macho hauda kuchinotora gohora acho manje ndipo uchi zvotoshamiswa ah mutu ndechi bage chakadai naye uchitarisa muimwe zvinoita mutsauko yes kuti ku itika kwe kwe program mainly ku kunoti batsira mafarmers e neruzivo zvezvo zvakakoshera kuita kurima nembeu zinenge dzakauchikwa e we hope that uh, this can we can take some of the seed fair to other to other areas where we are working this was more of a, a pilot to see how how we are doing so we'll probably come back during the season and assess and see that you know those farmers who were here are they growing orange maize are they growing uh, drought tolerant maize